Hey, did you know that May is Foster Care Appreciation Month? Yes, I did. Well, the Connecticut Department of Children and Families is helping local foster parents create better lives for children. Uh, Natalia, did I get that right? Yes. Liriano, did yes. I get that right? Absolutely. Oh my God, what a beautiful name. The Director of uh, Foster Care and Adoption is here to tell us how. Thank you so much for being with thank us. Thank you. Thank you. And thank, thank you for you. working and doing so many wonderful things for children in the state of Connecticut. Thank you so much. Thank no. you for having us oh, and giving us pleasure. an opportunity. So what's new? What's going on? Well, May is uh, Foster Care Appreciation Month, and that's nationally across the, the country. We're celebrating and appreciating our caregivers who actually answer the call when we call when a child is in care. Connecticut has, or nationally, there are about 300,000 um, children in care. Connecticut has about 2,000, wow. uh, 3,000 children, and about 2,500 2, under the age of 18 in care. Okay. And where are most of those children who may need to be placed? Um, in all over Connecticut. All over Connecticut, there isn't one state or one one city in Connecticut that is not effective. You would really? be amazed. Um, yeah, a lot of the fentanyl. There's a lot of substance abuse that brings children into care. And the department relies, relies, heavily relies on our caregivers, our licensed caregivers, to provide that support and maintain the connection um, to the community and families. Where are most of the kids placed? Um, you know, if they don't have a home to go to, where do they, where do they go? Well, the department's first and primary focus is to keep families together. Okay. Number one. Number one. So we try every possible um, avenue to ensure safety with their parents. If that is not possible, then we look to kinship. We look to relatives. And a lot of our kids, about 48% of our kids, are actually with their relatives. That's okay, really that's nice. good. That's no, good. it's an ama and nationally we support kinship. That's our number one because mm -hmm. it's just better outcomes. It's just mm -hmm. better outcomes for kids when they're with their family. And then the rest are with what we call um, unfamiliar caretakers. Okay. Mm -hmm. You know, so, um, and then we have a very, very small percentage of children who are in congregate care. Very, very small what is, percentage. What does that mean, congregate care? Talk. Like in a facility. In a facility. Group, group home okay. or residential. But usually those are high end children with, you know, psychiatric or mental health. The majority of our kids, 98% of our kids, are with family in a family setting. Wow, okay, that's terrific. huge. That's a big statistic. That is. I mean, Connecticut, I, I'm proud to say from Connecticut mm -hmm. that we have done a lot of work to reduce the number of kids that uh, have entered care. Mm -hmm. And I think since 2019, it's it's about 30%. So we only have 3,000 where when I started, we had four or 5,000 wow. or 6,000 kids in care. Wow, that's so remarkable. a lot of work has been done to reduce that number. Now, speaking of that work, if someone's watching and they're really interested in the process of becoming a foster parent, where can they go and how does that work? CTFosters.com. Com. CT Fosters. Dot com. Okay. We just launched a new brand, so our new brand is CT Fosters, right? Because in Connecticut, we foster relationship, we fo foster families, we foster empowering our fam uh, community. So they can go to CT Fosters to get information. Anyone could come, get information, um, and figure out if it's something that they want to do. Terrific. Well, yeah, thank you so great. much for thank your time. You. Thank you. Thank you so much for the it. opportunity. Uh, we'll see you again next month. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Because May is not the only month that we appreciate families. Absolutely. Right. Thanks so much, Thank Natalia. You. We appreciate Thank it. You. Thank you.